Hi, welcome to SimplyScuba.com. In this session, we're taking a look at the Innotova IC14 camera with underwater housing. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. So we start off with some facts and figures about the camera itself first. 14 megapixel, so take a nice large photo. Also shoots in full HD 720p video, so you can get some good little videos out of this as well. So really ideal for maybe if you're going off to the Red Sea or somewhere nice this season. Take some nice video to take home with you. The housing itself as well is rated to 54 metres, so it's going to be nice and robust. Keep your camera nice and safe inside. While on the housing, we can take a look at some of its features. Good strong design, as mentioned before. Nice and comfortable in the hand as well. Got a nice good grip on the side here, so you can get a good purchase to it when using the camera. Good function control on here as well. On the top, you've got the on button and also the shutter button. And on the back, you've got full control over all of the camera's functions using the buttons on the side here. Don't tend to get this with a lot of housing, so this is a great little added feature they've included. When it comes to the locking me mechanism as well for keeping the camera inside the housing, little lock button on the side to prevent you from accidentally opening up the housing while underwater, so that's an, again a nice little feature. Flick it up to unlock it, which you then give this a pull forward, and that opens up the housing inside. We've obviously got the O-ring on the outside there to keep the camera nice and dry. Some rubberized sections around the back here as well just to keep that camera in place and stop it from moving around. Good lanyard on here as well, so obviously wrap it around your wrist to keep it nice and safe. If we move on to the camera itself, just pop the housing to one side. Nice small design, obviously the benefit of being able to remove it from the housing means you can use the camera elsewhere as well, not only underwater on your dive. Turning it on is nice and simple, introduce the button on the top. You've got five times optical zoom on the front here as well, so a good amount of zoom on there for capturing those images a little further away. As we said before, shutter button on the top, and then around on the bottom you've got access to all the controls and functions. 2.7 inch LCD screen on the back there as well, so a nice large colour display, and as you can see you get access to a lot of information on there to help you take a good photo. Zoom controls at the front. You've then got the mode button below that as well for switching between photo and video. Access to other controls below there as well, so you've got your macro functions, your flash, your timer settings, and then below that we've got your menu and also your settings to view any images. Obviously no images in here at the moment. However, in the pack you also do get not only the camera and the housing, also included is a 2 gigabyte SD card. A little white slate for white balancing, so another great little extra. Also some instructions on the back of how to use the white balancing itself. All the cables you need for not only attaching it to your TV, but also to your PC or Mac as well. Little lanyard for the camera itself to again keep it nice and safe when out of the water. And also comes with a handy little pouch as well to keep again nice and safe and prevent everything getting scratched. So fantastic value for money, you've got a fantastic little camera here as well for taking your photos like we said before and your HD video which is a great added bonus and you've also got that great underwater housing keeping it nice and safe while underwater. So a fantastic little package. Come and take a closer look here at simplyscuba.com.